Today we're creating a point-to-point -point GRE tunnel to direct packets from the firewall to a cloud service while they're on their way to a particular end destination. Here's a diagram of our topology. We're directing packets to the cloud service, for example, because the cloud service implements URL filtering on them. Our firewall interface is one tunnel endpoint, and a router or another firewall in the cloud service is the other tunnel endpoint. We create a tunnel interface by selecting Network, Interfaces, Tunnel, and adding a new interface. The name is Tunnel, and after the dot, we enter the number of the tunnel. We add a comment, and we assign the tunnel interface to a virtual router. We assign it to a Layer 3 security zone. We can add an IPv4 or IPv6 address to the tunnel interface, or both. We'll select IPv4 and add a new address object. We'll name it Tunnel A. Select IP Netmask and enter the address. The tunnel interface addresses at each end of the tunnel should be on the same subnet, which in this case is 192.168.2. We assign an IP address to our Ethernet interface. Select Network, Interfaces, Ethernet. Select an interface. It must be a type of layer 3. And select a virtual router, the same one you used before. Select a security zone. And we'll assign the address. Choose the IPv4 tab and static. We'll add an address. And on the Advanced tab, select a management profile to allow services such as pings. Now we create the GRE tunnel. Select Network, GRE Tunnels, and add a tunnel by name. We'll call it GRE. Select the interface to use as the local GRE tunnel endpoint. This is the source interface. We select Ethernet 1.1, which we configured. For the local IP address, choose the address of the interface that you just created. The interface could have more than one IP address. There's our address. For the peer address, we'll add 10.1.1.3. And now for the tunnel interface, select the tunnel that you first created. Note that the local and the peer IP addresses don't need to be directly connected. This is just for demo purposes. Accept or change the TTL value of 64, that's the TTL of the IP packet encapsulated inside the GRE packet. We'll let that default. If your network uses QoS and depends on type of service bits to enforce QoS policies, select Copy TOS Header to copy the TOS field from the inner IP header to the outer IP header in the encapsulated packets. This preserves the original TOS information. Next, we enable the Keep Alive function for the tunnel. It's a best practice so that if the tunnel goes down, the firewall removes the route 
to the tunnel from its forwarding table and can then use your backup route. We must now route the traffic that we want going to the cloud service on its way to the destination server to go through the GRE tunnel. Select Network, Virtual Routers, our default virtual router, and Static Routes. We're going to add an IPv4 static route and name it. The interface is the outgoing interface for our GRE tunnel, which is tunnel.2. The next hop is the peer IP address, enter 192.168.2.3. The destination is the network of the destination server. Enter 192.168.3.0 slash 24. Click OK. And click OK. And commit. Now we're going to configure the device at the other end of the tunnel. Here we are logged into the firewall at the other end of the tunnel. It's tunnel.1. Its IP address is 192.168.2.3/24. For our Ethernet interface, we have Ethernet 1.1 with the IP address 10.1.1.3 slash 24. For our GRE tunnel, the tunnel endpoint is Ethernet 1 slash 1. It's got an IP address of 10.1.1.3 slash 24, and the peer, as we already set up, is 10.1.1.1. And the tunnel interface is the tunnel we just configured, Tunnel.1. Finally, we created a static route to the network address of client A, which is 192.168.8.0/24. We want that traffic to take Tunnel1, and the next hop for the route is the opposite end of the tunnel, which is 192. Dot one sixty eight dot two dot one. Now we ping the peer IP address to test the GRE tunnel. Here we are logged into the second firewall. We ping. And we see that the pings are successful. They're going over the GRE tunnel.